Hello everyone, today let's briefly talk about the Western Digital Drive. Okay, it's a brief introduction about uh, how to identify the family of WD Drive uh, as well as how to find a donor of the Western Digital Drive. Okay, let's start by identifying the drives. So the WD Drive, actually the, the families are identified by the PCB shapes and currently there are five families uh, to our tool. There are civil one, civil two, black one, black two, and the uh, RYL. Okay, so now let's look at the civil one series. And you can see the shape of the civil one is like this on the picture. There's three dots. The light layout of three dots is like this. That's a mark basically to identify civil one. But civil one is quite old. So we we actually we don't have that on the market right now. So it's, it's obsolete and uh, it's, it's phasing out. And uh, also let's look at Civil 2. Capacity of Civil 2 is usually from uh, 40 gigas to 120 gigas. And the only difference between Civil 1 and Civil 2 and the uh, layout of the marks on the PCB. So Civil 2 would be like this. And the Civil 1 would be like this. So this is the only difference between them. And also, let's look at the black one. So black one has a little bit different shape of the PCB here. It looks like an L. It looks like a fat L. And this is the difference, the shape between the black one and silver series. And also black two is like this. The difference between silver two and uh, black on the black two, there is no marks like PCB marks like the the ones on the civil two and the last one last family is RYL so RYL is is a little bit similar to the black one but you can see the RYL has this PCB shape of RYL is more steep over here the edge of uh, RYL is more steep than the ones of the black one and for the RYL so uh Nowadays, all the WD drives will be RYL series, and all the 2.5 inches laptop drives is RYL series, and has some new functions like uh, disable rooms, ACL format, or module deflection, and read-only test in functions. These these functions are not supported by our tool. We're going to talk about the ROM and the WD drive. Okay. The ROM, which is also the flash ROM, contains the head number, uh, platinum number, and head map. So for the old WD drives, the ROM is, is 27C, so it's a read-only ROM. So for this ROM, you cannot do the operations like uh, depop head because it's read-only. So if you're going to depop head with a drive that has a 27C ROM chip, you have to change it to other uh, ROM chips like uh, 29F. Or others. So for uh, for W drive, only 27C is read only. The rest of the ROMs are okay for any operation. So the rest of the ROMs will be 29F and 25P10 and 25F10. Okay, now we're going to talk about how to find a donor drive for the WD drive. Okay, so uh, if we're going to find a donor, first you need to find a a uh, drive with the with the same model and the same PCB. This is very basic. Whatever you're going to find a donor, like find donor PCB or donor firmware, whatever you're going to do, you have to find a drive with the same model and same PCB number. And uh, more to find, I think, to my experience, is uh, the country code and also the the date it, it was manufactured. It has the date and the country code they have to be close or identical okay so if we're going to find a WD firmware a donor firmware for the white one series okay you need to find a similar model number and of course with the same capacity and the same uh, firmware version the firmware version is important and for the white 2 black 1 and black 2 and RYL you need to find the same model number Okay, and the same firmware version. So basically, same model and same firmware version. 
uh, for the new drives of WD like RYL, so uh, the, the model number consists of two parts, so we need to find the donor one with the same first part and the middle second part. So for example, if the patient model is WD1600 BEVS dash RST0, so we need to find the donor one with the, with the one is WD1600 BEVS dash XXRSXX. XX means um, it can be different, but other parts should be the same. So if we're going to find a donor PCB, we need to find the same model and same PCB version. So that's it, same PCB number, which is PCB version. So uh, in one sentence, if we're going to find a donor hardware, like PCB, you need to find the same model and same PCB number. So if you're going to find a donor firmware, you need to find the same model and same firmware version. And that's it. And also to my experience, you need to find a drive with a same country code and similar production date and of course uh, same LBA same which is same capacity and uh, SN should be close so that create that will be increasing the chance of success rate okay and, and something else if you're going to find a, a donor head you need to find the same model and uh, drive with the same DCM number DCM number is here, if you can see here on the sticker, DCM. So if you're going to find a donor head, you need to find the drive with same model and same DCM. Okay. So that's it. So much for the introduction of WD. Thank you.